Good morning, super cool party people, and welcome back for another fun-filled day of adventure. And also the start of my Monday to Friday slash Tuesday to Saturday vlogs. So today is Monday, this is the first time I am vlogging since I stopped vlogging on Thursday. I mean, technically I tried to vlog Friday morning and I was just like, I'm out, I'm no, bored. But I had like a super productive weekend, which is great. And so, I mean, it's lending validity to this not vlogging on the weekend thing, but I mean, we'll see how it goes because it could have just been productive because I had one day off on the weekend, which has not happened for a while. But on Saturday, I worked. And then I spent a lot of time setting up goals, like writing goals, exercise goals, all that fun stuff, and setting it up on my dry erase board in my room, and then not hitting any of them that day. <laughs> I mean, in all fairness, I set up the goals to start on Sunday because I was like, let's be honest, we're not going to write today. I think I wrote just over a thousand words, but yeah. Yesterday, however, we made strides so i know i mentioned before but i've been working on this fun project as well as my book that i should actually be writing and so i set a goal for both of them not because i need to write x amount for this but because i need to write x amount for this so the goal is the same for both of them it's 2000 words a day but for this one it's the goal i want to hit and for this one it's the goal that once i hit it we're gonna stop writing so we'll see how that works fingers crossed it'll work out. And yesterday I actually wrote slightly more for my actual book than my fun project. So, you know, that I'm calling that a win. Also, because I'm super competitive, I'm doing a high score for my word count. So every time I get a new high score with the two combined, then I'll put it in the high score slot. So, I mean, we'll see, we'll see how much further we can get. It's, it's just over 4,000 now, so it should be pretty easy to hit next time. But yeah, I think that's it. I think we're caught up on the weekend. It was super productive. I felt great. I worked out though, so like, I'm sore today. I'm not like super sore. It's just like the vestiges of soreness on like the outer layers of my body, which is definitely on my muscles, but it's cool. Oh, also, yesterday when I went to edit my changes video, which I'll try to remember to link there, but if not, I'll try to remember to link there, but if I don't, it was my last video. <laughs> I know my... I know my limitations. Anyway, I was like, oh, I'll update my editing program because it's asking me to. And oh, whoa, 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 man, was that an update. It like went from looking like what I was used to to looking very similar to Adobe Premiere, I believe. So that's gonna take a little bit of learning, but it's cool, we'll get there. Um, might just take take a few days, but I'm excited. I didn't have I didn't look at like all the features it has now, but I'm excited that maybe it has features similar to Premiere. So that would be awesome because I've been thinking like maybe I should switch to Premiere, but maybe I don't need to now. But gonna have to take a couple days probably to get my head around this and figure it out better. But yeah, okay. So now I think we're fully updated on the weekend, and I'm gonna go get to work, and then we have a staff meeting today, and then I'll probably work some more and. It'll be a long day, but we're gonna we're gonna hit goals and we're gonna get stuff done. Alrighty, so I am done for the day, which is super exciting. It has been a long day. It was longer than I thought, but the staff meeting ended up getting cancelled, so that was a blip, but it's cool. This lighting is just it's terrible because I turned off all the lights. I'll just go stand by some art. Maybe it'll be better. Eh. Anyway, um, I'm gonna, I think, head home now, maybe get some food on the way, I'm not sure, and then gonna do some dinner prep, and then gotta hit some goals, gotta do some writing, and writing, and then work out. Although, I did, when I was planning my week this week, I put four days in for this week, but I worked out yesterday, which was Sunday, which I didn't account for, so I only have to work out three more times, so if I don't wanna work out today, I don't need to, so we'll see, but yeah, home time. I'm really hungry though, so maybe for the time, it's tough. Okay, so I like just got home. It's been like two hours since I got off work, uh, but you know how it is, you get eating, you get talking, you get chatting, whatever. Um, I think it's, it's about four now. I'm guessing my sister-in-law will probably be home around five for dinner, so 
should go get some food prepping done. I've got, I love these socks. They have squids on them. Um, and I'm also just currently like texting with Pam and also with Jessica if she would text me back because I have, I have a character in my books, oh the socks, that I need a maiden last name for and it's also kind of important so I was like here's my thoughts what do you guys think and then I'm like okay but does that really work so sometimes you just need to like back and forth with somebody on something so working on that now so I am actually working on writing I'm just not actually writing I think that'll have to happen after dinner and if I want to work out it's gonna have to happen after dinner as well so we'll see how I feel my body feels great though when I first woke up I think I mentioned I had like the vestiges of sore like here like it was like my skin was sore even though I noticed the muscles uh, but right now we're doing fantastic so we should probably work out so it gets worse right <laughs> anyway I'm gonna put on oh let's do this let's put on the blind channel sweater we love the blind channel sweater um and then go upstairs and get some potatoes cut because we're gonna do homemade hash browns which are delicious, and then do, 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 do. bagels with lettuce, tomato, egg, and bacon. Sounds like a good plan. The lighting's really messed up. I know, it's cool. Um, but yeah, so I will check in with you probably in a little bit. Hopefully next time you see me, I will be like making goals happen and sitting out computer and typing or something fun like that. Fingers crossed. Okay, so I'm just about done cooking dinner and um, my body is starting to hurt. I think it's from the working out yesterday. Oh, let's do this. Let's get a lot closer. Um, so I think after dinner, I'm gonna go, maybe not right away, I'll probably do some writing and then we'll jump on the cardio machines. This is not at all comfortable. Like, I'm about to fall off this chair. Anyway, um, yeah, we're having delicious, delicious food, which is gonna make my tummy feel so bad because it's so greasy. So I'm gonna try not to eat a ton and then that way I can you know exercise later because I think I need to but yeah I think dinner spend like an hour writing and then we'll go work out because yeah my body's trying to get stiff I've been drinking a lot of water but ooh, I don't think that's going to win here I smell like bacon and deep fryer and I'm not sure if I'm mad about it or if I'm okay with it I'm trying to decide. Also, I've noticed that my sports bra matches my glasses, like the exact color. And the other day, I can't remember if I mentioned it on the vlog or not, I don't think I did, but I had like a lighter pink bra and something else that matched it. And I was like, match your sports bra to your something ridiculous. Anyway, I think we're gonna head to the store here for some quick groceries. And then when we get back, hopefully I can do some writing before I go and try to do the exercise -y thing and all that fun stuff. And then also I'll be glad when I get home because I can change and not smell like bacon and deep fried oil. It's, it's a smell, it's a smell. Okay, so we were shopping for a little bit longer than I anticipated we would be. I was like an hour and a bit, but that's cool because I found hand creams. These are my favorite hand creams right here and they're on sale for $2.50 each which is like they're normally like five bucks so I bought four because I'm almost out of my two that I currently have and you gotta have backups but because yeah I'm not wearing pants always um, but because we were out a little bit longer I'm gonna jump right up into the exercise room I think and try to like exercise I'm not feeling it but I'm sure we'll feel it once we get up there so I need to put on pants because like I said I'm not wearing pants and um, then I should be pretty much right and, and grab a sweater because it's gonna be cold up there to start I think I'm gonna go with these ones my Reebok floral ones and maybe this bright yellow shirt because I got a problem and everything I own is either patterned or bright colors but yeah so that's what we're gonna do I'll grab my sweater right here we'll get changed and we will go walk out I am dying I'm like halfway through this this being the elliptical and then I got a bike and some stretching and some weights <sighs> we're dying a little I am like pink I've um decided I don't want to do the bike, so I'm laying down pretending to stretch. I'm not actually stretching, um, but I should get up here in a minute and stretch. <sighs> but yeah, I think I just, I mean, I, I know I ate like two hours ago now, but I'm feeling like a little bleh. 
from it, I think, is what it is. So I'm just gonna take it a little bit easier today. So once I stop being lazy, I'm going to get up and I will um, stretch and do some weights, probably. Hopefully, but even if I don't, at least I got something in. Okay, I survived. My cheeks are as pink as my glasses, but it's fine because everything matches. See, it's it's supposed to be. So I ended up getting on the bike at the very end because I didn't feel as much like throwing up. <laughs> and I figured my poor sore legs, which was the main reason I wanted to work out today, need it. So I, I did that and we'll see if that helps tomorrow. I'm also, I think this is like, I'm trying to math because these are $7.50 each. Anyways, this is my fourth or fifth one today. I'm not sure. So we're drinking lots of water, trying to hydrate that body because it definitely needs it. But now I am at my computer. Am I still in my workout gear? I definitely am because I don't know. I just, maybe it's gross, but I don't like to change out of them right away because they're so sweaty. So I just let the sweat dry and then I take them off. That's gross, isn't it? I think it's gross. Yeah, whatever. It's my life. So now I have some writing goals to hit. It is 8.30 and my writing goal for the day combined is about 4,000, which is a lot of words. I can do about 2,000 an hour if I'm going well, like if I've got all the ideas, 2,000 an hour, totally good. Right now, unfortunately, for especially the one project, not so much. It's a, it's a struggle. So yeah, I have two different writing goals. If, if you've been here like over the last week, I've been talking about a fun project that I'm working on. So that fun project is actually rewriting my Harry Potter fan fiction that I wrote forever ago. Mainly it's because I just, I needed a break from writing this book. Um, and there's no commitment, there's no like judgment, nobody's ever going to see it other than like a few friends. So. It's great, like I can just write that, not worry about anything, don't have to be like, oh my god, is the continuity going to be okay? Like, it's a distressor. And I really love writing, so even using another writing project as a distressor is like great for me. The problem is, I have a problem. And last week I start I decided to start writing this fanfiction on Monday, and by Thursday I'd put ten thousand words into it and I'd only put about 3,000 words into my actual book. And I mean, in all fairness, 13,000 words in a week is a great writing output, but th it was in the wrong spot. So my two goals are both 2,000 words a day. So 2,000 words for my book, but if I do more, that's great. But once I hit 2,000 words in my fanfiction, I need to stop and go do the 2,000 words in my book if I haven't done them yet. That's the goal. We're gonna see if it worked. It worked yesterday. I did 2044 in my fan fiction and then I stopped and I switched over to the actual book and I did 2120 about so it worked yesterday we'll see if it keeps working but yeah I don't know what I'm going to work on I should technically start with my book because if I run out of time it would make more sense to spend the time on my book but we'll see what I feel when I open up the documents but that's that's you caught up on what my writing goals are and why I have to have that writing goal if I have to stop at 2000 because I have a problem. It's a good problem to have, but it's a problem. I'm really enjoying it. I love writing so much. Okay, I'm gonna go. Okay, so I have definitely changed into my cozy sweats and my things that I sleep in pajamas. I forgot the word. No, I was looking at my pants. I was like, workout pants? Those are not workout pants. They have owls on them though. They're pretty cute. Um, Jessica and I have a matching pair because we're winners like that. We like to get matching pajamas. Anyway, um, it is just about 10.30 now and I did reach a writing goal for the day. I didn't reach them both, but I reached the correct one. So I wrote 2,300 words of my actual book and nothing of my fan fiction, but it's totally cool. I think that was the right thing to do. And I probably could have kept writing, but I was just like, I don't want to write anymore. I just stopped, not mid-sentence, which I've done to myself before, but I like wrote the first sentence in a paragraph. I'm like, I'm out. The nice thing is though is, so I'm, the nice thing is though is I'm, 14 pages into the rewrite. I'm only six pages into the original because I've added so much stuff. But I'm now getting to the point where I can actually kind of draw from the stuff I wrote previously. So that's very exciting. And I'm really, I think I'm gonna start enjoying this again soon. So fingers crossed because we have a long month and a half to two months ahead of us to hit the goal that I'm aiming for. That's so long, but I think I'm gonna sleep now. My body is sore. There's your update. It's 
it's sore. <laughs> it's not terribly sore, but it's a little bit sore. So I'm going to drink some more water. I did finish that um, bottle that I had. But I'm just like peeing like crazy. But I feel like I need to drink more water. I don't know. It's 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 bad. <laughs> drink some water. Pee some more. Fill up water bottle. Repeat. Anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna go to sleep now because it is 10:30, and my body needs to recover because I've been pushing it hard, and my brain needs to recover because I've been pushing that hard. So with that, I'm going to say thanks so much for coming along on today's adventure, and I will see you tomorrow when we do probably some pretty similar things. <laughs> Good night. <laughs>